All right, guys, uh, we're gonna be doing another jog. Uh, uh, this one right now that we're looking at, we're gonna be doing it with a toggle switch. Again, these are our toggle switches. All it, toggle switches, all it does is change from position on or position off. So again, uh, we already did the one with resistors. Uh, we have another one with uh, where we do uh, both the normally close and normally open on, on, the, on one of the buttons. So uh, again, so there's different ways and we're gonna be doing one with uh, relays. So this one happens to be the one with the jog. Again, uh, same thing, the power comes in, you have your uh, wire number one comes in here, and then you're able to see, uh, then from power uh, number one goes to three and it goes to your uh, jog button. So here, uh, his number one goes over to his, uh, uh, to his uh, start button, and then he goes over to the jog, from the jog, he brings it over and he hits his uh, auxiliary, right there, from the, and then from the auxiliary he hits, he hits his uh, M2 coil, and then, uh, and then from, uh, uh, from uh, 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 M A2, he goes over to his overload right here, and then of course he brings it back to his neutral right there. So let's check out how this works out right there. So uh, again, uh, power, uh, gonna get power, take out the lock. Very important to maintain your uh, uh, safety right there. So lock out, tag out every time you're not using it. So here we go. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, run it. Uh, again, uh, right now, this guy is, uh, is set on, on jog. If I put it on, uh, all I gotta do is press it and now the motor's running at its, it's regular speed. So normally you're gonna have it there. That's the, uh, when you're gonna be running normal motor. But again, you have, in case something happens, the belt rips or something like that, you have to fix it and you have to get it to the right position. Uh, again, you stop the motor. Uh, you switch your position to this to, uh, you know, uh, that way it won't run directly. Now with the same button that I started it, now I'm gonna jog it. So it's gonna go a lot slower. Again, you're gonna be able to move it to the position that you want. You're able to move that to, and then you're able to do your maintenance and fix whatever you need to do. So again, that's the thing about with uh, a jogging control. As maintenance technicians, or as electricians, we use that quite a bit. So it's important that you guys understand how to use a lot of this stuff right here. Again, uh, he brings power from his block uh, into the uh, in, because they go in into his uh, uh, contactors, they go out, this is out, and then he connects his motor according to what the uh, diagram shows him right here. Again, uh, uh, diagram shows uh, one to seven, two to eight, uh, three to nine, and of course you connect your uh, four, five, and six together. So that's what he did for five and six, they're connected together right here. And then uh, one to uh, 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 one to seven, uh, two to eight, uh, uh, three to nine. See, this one's going right to his nine right there. So again, uh, that's the way we do a lot of this right here. So, all right, thank you. And we'll be doing the other video on, uh, on, uh, on uh, relay. So uh, again, with jogging, all right, thank you.